It occurred to me this might happen, but still... Damn mutineered beasts! All their honor and tradition isn't worth a pile of hellhound dung. Yep, Arcadian and Hosmon parties all right. I don't know. But they look smarter than you, old man. Shut your trap, boy. The Arcadian's concept of war is the prehistoric, honorable one-on-one -on -one duel. As for those Hosmans, their country is a joke. Bunch of filthy farmers. Oh, cut it out. There's been a truce. Besides, there are allies. For now. That's enough. All you plan to do is take advantage of us. We will not let you do as you please. The mere thought of joining up with the Nordis makes me ill. Ha! Huh, we might as well just surrender. Our honor is at stake in this task. Not that I expect a party of Nordis brutes to understand a knight's dignity. Just who do you think you are? Me, unlike you, I will not be the slave of such a disgraceful party. What? You talk like that damn twerp. Huh? Hey, leave me out of this. You guys, fight on your own. I could care less. It amuses me that the Nordics are plagued with people like you. Even the twerp despises you. You are such a piece of crap. I heard Arcadians were conceited, but this is too much, you forest freak. You're calling me conceited? I believe it is more than evident who the conceited one is here. The Nordists sneer at distinguished tradition and history, yet all they care about is money. You don't have an ounce of integrity in You don't like to time. choose sides, huh? No. I mean, what's the big deal? Honor? Tradition? Who cares? Say, you're a Hosmon, aren't you? I'm Yamp. And that's Ulk. I haven't seen many Nordis folk, but I guess some are more relaxed like you. Oh, it's the soldiers who are so stuck up. And me? I am just a civilian. Oh, well. The elemental disorder, you call it? My Nana died last year because of that. I heard it could be stopped, which is why I came, but everyone here is just mad. I wonder how long they'll be at it. Yeah, who knows? Enough! I tire of your bickering. Why don't you just do it out? At least that would accomplish something. Eek! Oh no! Come on, Ulk, it's too confusing here, and we're of no use anyway. Let's leave, okay? Hold on! Calm down, everyone! We're all here for the same reason, right? To neutralize the elemental disorder. Now, if anyone wants to go home, fine, take a hike. It'll only confirm that you aren't up to the task anyway. Hold your tongue. I'm more than prepared to end this chaos myself. Yet I won't do it as a Nordic stooge. Then there's no need to get so upset, right? We're here to neutralize the disorder. Hey, I just don't want to be given orders by that little dictator, Dean. Yeah, 
Me neither. I personally don't have any objections to whoever ends up as our leader. All I'm saying is this. I will not serve under a Nordist soldier, especially that dimwit. Yeah? Well, I'll die before taking orders from this mutineered son of a bitch. So, who's going to bring this team together then? Um, how about Evan? He told me himself he's not a soldier. What? Me? Hmm. It did say in our orders that Evan was the leader. Plus, he is a ranger, which is helpful. Oh no. Now, hold on. You heard me complain back there. I I'm not cut out to be a leader. You're not? Didn't you just say that you couldn't care less about our differences? He'll do fine. Everyone seems willing to support you. He who is one with the land finds many a path, and is to be respected. I do not object to Evan. If he is not a soldier, then my honor will not be tarnished. Are you serious? You want to listen to this twerp's whiny voice? Well, frankly speaking, it's better than listening to your constant complaining. All right, Evan. You have been chosen. Take us to Loka Village. Oh man, what did I get myself into now? <laughs>